everyone, welcome back to Herky the Cavalier's channel. I'm here today with Herky and Milton and we wanted to talk about one of our favorite spots in California and that is Huntington Beach, Dog Beach. And if you haven't seen our latest video, I'll be inserting it up here about the girls playing at Huntington Beach and you can just see how much fun they have when we go there. And during our last trip in February with the girls, we spent about six days <laughs> at the beach visiting Huntington Beach so that just gives you an idea of how much we loved it and how much they love it as well so just to give you a bit of insight on Huntington Beach so Huntington Beach is located off the Pacific Coast Highway also known as the PCH it's a 1.5 mile stretch between 21st okay, no, between 21st and Seapoint it's open daily between 5 a.m. and 10 p.m. and it's open seven days a week so basically every day of the year you can go there with your pup from dusk till dawn there's a lot of street parking available on the PCH for about 150 per hour which is very reasonable we don't usually spend more than three hours there so it's about 450 for parking there's also public restrooms available and your dog is required to be leashed when you enter and when you exit the beach there's also a bike path all along the beach and your dog is required to be leashed on the path. You can walk with your dog on the path as well. It can be very, very busy on weekends and summer months, so just plan accordingly. There's poo bag dispensers, so if ever you forget your poo bags, you're covered, all they ask and as a courteous dog owner is that you pick up your dog's poo right after they poo and you get rid of it accordingly. You are also required to keep your dog in sight and under your control at all times. There's no aggressive dogs allowed, no sick dogs allowed, no female dogs in heat allowed, and puppies over four months of age can go, no younger than that. It also says that you should have their collars and tags on when you go to the beach, which I totally agree with. However, I saw this rule that said that you should have the vaccination and licensing certification with you. Um, that's odd. I, I never brought it with me, but you know, it says that you should. You should let your dog chase wildlife, for example, birds and seagulls. So just be careful with that. I know it's sometimes not easy to control what your dog runs after, but it says so in the rules. And of course, just be courteous to other dogs, other dog owners. Just try to control your dog as much as possible. It's not all dogs that want to play. Not all dogs are as friendly as yours. Your dog may want to play, but other dogs such as Herky and Milton, they don't always want to interact with other dogs. They always like to be left by themselves and play with us more than with other dogs. So just be conscious of that. And also the water, every time we went is really, really cold. We did go in October and in February, so it's not smack summer months, but Pacific Coast water is usually pretty cold. So I don't think it's swimmable to my standards, but Herky and Milton do like to go in the water sometimes. There's no separation for big dogs and small dogs. So you're basically left there in an open, huge space for dogs to run and to play. So if your dog is a bit more shy, just be mindful of that. There can be bigger dogs roaming around. The place overall is super clean and I've never stumbled upon any poop whatsoever. So that's really good. I think dog owners that go to Huntington Beach are pretty mindful and respectful. So that's really good. It's super clean. It's very big. I just love the sunsets there too. So if you can spend the end of the day there you'll be sure to catch a really really nice sunset if ever you want to spend the day there with your dog there's also a lot of restaurants nearby there's an in and out there's a lot of Vietnamese food because you're really close to little Saigon and that's pretty much it it's one of our favorite spots we always go there whenever we have the time and whenever we visit California so hopefully this gives you a good insight of what Huntington Beach is like um, we just absolutely love it thank you so much for watching we love you and we'll see you soon